Hi, this is Nicole D'Alessio, and I'm going to teach you how to add text to a photo using Fonto with a PH. That is available for free download on iOS or Android. So first I'm opening Fonto, and I've already taken my photo, so I'm going to choose the little camera button icon and tap that. And I'm going to go into my photo albums and pull in my photo. Here's the silhouette that I already made in Snapseed. I also have a tutorial for this, several of them actually. And I'm not going to add any filters because I want the high contrast black and white. I'm going to press done. And there's my photo which popped up. And I'm going to just tap on the photo anywhere when I where I want to add text. And as soon as I tap on it, it says add text. And I tap on it again. And I have my cho students choose five words to describe themselves for a language arts product project and then I can choose my font too so if I don't like that font there's a whole bunch of other like fantastic fonts to choose from and I'll choose one and there's some other little settings down here you can play with but I don't necessarily need to do that I'm going to press done now and then up, up pops another menu of choices so I'm going to just tap and hold and push my text to where I want it to be but it's a little bit too big so I can choose my little size button and make it a little bit smaller and push it around again and then there's a whole bunch of other different uh, little settings here too so maybe I want to tilt it and you can also fiddle around with the style there's a whole bunch of different colors you can choose and you can also add a stroke or different backgrounds and you can create color patterns and get super fancy um, I'm just going to leave mine white because I'm going to keep it real simple so there I've got my text and if I want to add more text all I have to do is tap on another spot where I want to add the text two times and add in a new word and you can change the font again and then press done and you just do that same step over and over again and there you go when you're finished go to the bottom right hand corner there's a little square with an arrow I tap that and I'm going to save my image because that's the workflow that I like to do. And it will save a copy to my camera roll and I'm finished. Have fun.